Welcome to Yosemite National Park, America's oldest protected public land. It's uh, the second national park uh, signed into law by Willie Henry Harrison in, uh, I don't know, like late 1800s? So, uh, yeah. My name's Taylor and I'm a fake national park expert. Let me be your guide to the world of fabulous national parks. Yosemite is located in North California. It's known for its sheer granite cliffs, spectacular waterfalls, world-class hiking, and enormous crowds of nature nuts. Over 5 million people a year visit this park. Most people stick to the 7 by 1 mile wide main valley, but the park is fairly large and has a lot to see outside of the main valley. Two epic hiking trails cross through the park, the John Muir Trail and the Pacific Crest Trail. To avoid the masses, we decided to see this park in the dead of winter, with chance to view an extra special bonus phenomena. For two weeks in mid-February, amateur photographers from around the world come out to view and capture the elusive firefalls. The setting sun hits a little waterfall at the right angle and creates the illusion of a firefall. Not to be confused with the historic man-made firefall where some dude would literally push a bonfire over a cliff every night. Oh, the 60s. We came for the harmless natural version. A lot can go wrong when trying to see this bad boy. The weather needs to be clear. It has to be above freezing so that the falls is actually running and you have to get a good viewing angle. For photography, some of the best spots start filling up around noon. We decided not to risk it and lock in a good spot early. It's one o'clock, we're set up at Horsetail Falls and we're hoping to glimpse the Majestic Firefall. It's gonna start in about four hours and hopefully we'll get to see this bad boy alight. With nothing to do but drink beer and take time lapses, we did our fair share of both. As the hours marched along, the sky became cloudier and hazier. Our chances were diminishing by the minute. But while chatting with some friendly neighbors, we noticed something. Oh my God, we have seen the firefall at Yosemite. It's pretty amazing. Can't you see? Gorgeous blues and reds and oranges. Fabulous. You guys are really going to enjoy this. Fooled you. Okay, so I'm not a master clickbaiter. More on that in a moment. You know what that means. It's time for a special edition presidential fun fact. There's a common misconception that old Teddy Westside invented the national park system. While he did lay a ton of groundwork, it's not really the whole story. The first instance of public land protection was actually signed into law by this guy, generally regarded at the time as the worst president ever by half the country. <laughs> Civil War. When he signed the Yosemite Grant in 1864, it set a precedence for Yellowstone, the nation's first national park. The idea for conservation had its roots, and from there the tree of protection began to grow and blossom pine cones of preservation. Later, Theodore Roosevelt signed the Antiquities Act in 1906, which granted the president authority to create national monuments from public land. He wasted no time protecting over 150 million acres, mostly as national forests. But it wasn't until 1916, seven years after Roosevelt left office, that this sparkling intellectual sought to clear the bureaucratic mess of management by establishing the national park system we know today. Segway! A fantastic little place in Yosemite is located at Dewey Point. We drove up to Badger Pass and strapped on some snowshoes. The hike in was an incredible winter wonderland, all culminating with a beautiful view of the valley. It's a seven mile hike and with snowshoes it feels like nine, but the untouched wilderness and incredible vistas are definitely rewarding. Segway. All right, we're like T minus 10 minutes to countdown. Uh, doesn't look good so far. Actually, maybe it looks a little better now. A little orange right now. And uh, hopefully we're gonna see this falls light a light. I almost don't want it to do it because we have, oh my God, it's really happening. Oh my god, it's really happening! Oh my god, it's really happening! Look at this thing. It's like actually orange! up to leave I had a moment 
to figure out what makes Yosemite so awesome. And the reason is obvious, Yosemite is right out of a fairy tale. There is splendid scenery at every turn, as well as hidden surprises. It's no wonder Yosemite is a fabulous national park. Bye!